Good morning, Matilda. Good morning. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. I have 23 questions for you today. Are you ready? Yes. Let's do it in lab. Let's do it. All right. How do you start your day today? Oh, so this morning started with metabolic conditioning and lots of espresso. What's the first thing you do when you walk into the lab? Oh, grab some safety glasses. Good. Safety first. <laughs> okay, here we go. Good morning, Brad. Good morning, Kate. Good morning, Brad. <laughs> Um, so basically my job is to make the active ingredient shelf stable, um, safe for growers, and um, have desirable physical properties. Uh, favorite chemistry pet? Um, water expands when it freezes. What's some advice you give to your younger self? Uh, stop overthinking things. Oh, the spray dryer. Um, she's not hooked up today, but one of my favorite pieces of equipment. Who do you look up to? Uh, my parents. I just love them to death. Have you ever run your own business? Yes, I have. Good question. It's actually kind of related to formulation, so I started my own dog soap company. Cool. <laughs> uh, what was the first experiment that you ever did? I feel like maybe it's not um, super experiment um, worthy, but I remember in uh, first year, freshman year in college, our goal was to look at something and then guess the um, like the amount it weighs or the volume it took up. So I got really good at you know guessing those things, or I guess being right about those things. So that's fun to use today, even. <laughs> um, why agriculture? Uh, because it's so important. Like. Um, basically, we all depend on it so much, and I think for me, I'm able to see my direct impact um, a little bit easier. Um, what well, experience you've done with iBio? Uh, gone to uh, Uganda, by far, hands down, incredible experience. Oh my gosh, I'm jealous. <laughs> um, if you weren't a formulation chemist, what would you be? Um, probably something completely different. I kind of fell in love with this space, but um, maybe something crazy like, um, uh, you know, a personal trainer. I, I am a personal trainer, but maybe I do that full time. I don't know. Yeah. Who knows? <laughs> I like it. Um, lab work, desk work, or field work? Lab work all day. Early bird or night owl? Early bird. I cannot. I cannot hang at night. Mm -mm. <laughs> Pizza or tech? Oh, both. Good answer. <laughs> uh, last thing you listen to? Oh, um, shoot. It's a country song they play at every. Oh, Kane Brown. Um, yes, Kane Brown, thank God, with her, with his um, wife. Love that song. Oh, it's great. That. Yeah. Uh, what is the most impactful part about the work that you do? Most impactful uh, part. Um, I think it's really cool how um, Ag Biome, uh, their mission is to feed the world responsibly, and I get to help do that because I'm the one kind of at the end of the line helping to make those products that the growers see and then we eventually see. What are you most proud of in your career so far? Um, just, you know, the, the confidence I've gained in all of the places that my career has taken me. It's been super great. How would you describe yourself in three words? Oh, um, uh, positive, upbeat, and passionate. I agree. That was cool. <laughs> uh, one item you can't live without? Um, my stupid giant water bottle. I love it. Like, it goes everywhere with me. <laughs> Um, what, what do you think is the most important skill a scientist should have? Um, I guess uh, maybe it's less of a skill, but I think I, I'm a bit of a dreamer. And every time I go into the lab, I think, oh my gosh, like today's the day. Like we're going to get it right. So every day is the day. <laughs> if you could play a historical figure in a movie, who would it be? Historical figure in a movie. Who would it be? Um, I have no idea. <laughs> um, I love rom coms, so, but it's not historical. Um, oh, 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 oh. Maybe like Aaron Brockovich, like oh, Julia Roberts, like crushed oh, it. So, yeah, okay, here we go. Solving problems. <laughs> and last question What was the best thing happened to you so far this year? Best thing that's happened to me. Oh, um, we are uh, building a mountain house um, uh, near Asheville, and so we're getting really close uh, to it being done. So we've been making a lot of trips. So that progress has just been awesome. Awesome. Well, thanks so much, Kayla. Thank you, Matilda. Have a good day. <laughs>